Well, hello everyone, welcome back to Playframe and Monster Hunter World Iceborne and Astera. We haven't really hung out here too much in a while. I'm joined once more by uh, the person carrying me through the rest of this game, basically <laughs> fellow hunter, Dan Jones. Dan, how's it going? I know I'm not in the Gathering Hub yet, I'll, I'll be up there in a sec. How's it going though? You're missing out on a fiesta up here, man. Apparently there's another event going. <laughs> We, we were lucky. We we somehow picked the perfect recording schedule to meet every event. <laughs> <laughs> it's incredible. They just keep going. So some slight updates since last uh, session. I have done a little bit of work to A, get my Elder Dragon research bar filled up, you can see in the top corner. B, I've created some half-decent gear sets for Lance, Bow, and Charge Blade, which I'm wearing right now, so I'm... It's not like I'm going to use them any better, but I'll look nicer. See, I have acquired the most important Poogie uh, outfit that there is, which now you can see in motion and look at this little loaf. It's wonderful. He's a delight. <laughs> He's so good. <laughs> Absolute perfection. So round. Okay. I've petted the Poogie. We're all good. Let me come join you in the gathering hub and get some food. And I'm excited to also see what event is going on. I haven't gone up here yet. Ooh! Hey, the firework budget these people have is ridiculous. Gracious. <laughs> you wouldn't think this was an expedition. <laughs> you really wouldn't. Feels like we've kind of set up camp here and been here a while. By the time you're doing enormous fireworks shows multiple times a year, you're probably not an expedition anymore. <laughs> we are a settlement, at least, if not a society. <laughs> yeah. There's, there's, there's been like an entire generation <laughs> that's happened in this. Like, how do they even get this ship? I guess the ships fly because that's the whole other research base, right? Yeah, that's true. Fair point. We crash those a lot, huh? Yeah. We make a lot of our bases out of ships that we managed to not keep in the air. Look at that. You can't go a stone's throw without seeing a crashed ship. <laughs> it's everywhere. <laughs> you and Samson looking great still. Let's get some food. Should I should I change Samson? I haven't changed Samson once. Ooh, well, sure. I like I'd love to see some Samson fashion. No, oh, let's see. While well, I give me a meal. Oh, where does Samson have a little a little hidey home here? He should, right? Oh, yeah. Nope. Wait, that's an expedition. I don't know if there is a little cat spot here. Oh. There's gotta be, right? There's gotta be. You'd think. They definitely have one in Celiana, but maybe that's the thing that they added because they realized, oh, that would have been helpful. Yeah. Oh, well. It really seems like they should have one. Samson stays. <laughs> For now, maybe later. For now. Yeah. I've gotten some food now. Ooh. You know, in, in real life, in preparation, I... They've got fireworks in the ice sculpture. <laughs> you think that would, like, kind of go against the whole ice sculpture thing? Yeah, like... I'm impressed it's lasted this long. We're in... Yeah. A pretty tropical... Well, not tropical, but it's not cold. Uh, what's the, what's the word for that? Is that temperate? Is that is that the right? I think so. Or is that more warm? Hmm. I don't I don't know. Listen, tenth grade science Dan <laughs> knew the answer to this question. <laughs> he's long dead. He's he's so <laughs> dead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's let's um grab Man, that a quest. Quibbers, your mace is like blinding. It's very bright. It's very bright. I love how it pulses, too. Yeah, I went ahead and put Gwibbers in the uh, seething uh, basil gate. I've never... You'd think in one of the years since this game came out, I'd have tried to figure out how you're supposed to actually say the thing's name, but... Oh, well. Maybe... maybe it's you gotta, like, intentionally go wrong, like... Basil the juice. <laughs> yeah, let's see what we got. B-A-Z-E-L-G-E-U-S-E. Basil? Yeah, what if we did make it just sound very 
faux French kind of fr- French juice. Le gobo, si tu peux. <laughs> Basil juice. Sacre bleu. C'est basil juice. <laughs> this That's is perfect. sorry. <laughs> anyway, what we're actually fighting today, though, is something called a black veil Valhazak, which sounds rad. I don't know what it means, but can't wait. <laughs> oh, it's gonna go great, bud. Hooray! I'm so confident I'm going in with a charge blade, not even my lance. This is gonna be easy. It's nothing. I don't remember <laughs> where this lad is. I wanna say, like, two on the map, maybe? Area two? Okay. I like your called shot. Or actually, oh no, it might be seven. Because seven's like the tree. Tr- I, I don't remember. It's been so long whenever this game came out. <laughs> it's been some time. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna bet. Map seven. That's where he's gonna show up. Map seven. All right, hang on. Let me let me pull the let me pull the map up so we can. All right, map seven. Kind of like back here in this area. You know, I'll just go to the camp right next door. I'm calling it. Called shot. I love this. I'll let you know. Hang on. Drinking armor skin and demon drug because if I don't write this instant, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. it will not happen. Good call. Then I'll die, and... I already forgot. <laughs> Way ahead of you. I'm not even in the hunt. <laughs> <laughs> I did also remember to eat food. Also, in real life, I in preparation for this, I went, like, I got some takeout barbecue, and I ate what I would consider a pretty modest amount of barbecue as barbecue eating goes, and despite that, mm-hmm. and despite what this game, this whole series has led me to believe, wouldn't you know it, I still don't feel like fighting a dinosaur in real life yeah i had i had like a a little package of ramen and i'm like (laughs) i'm good (laughs) (laughs) i'm gonna need a bit before i feel like standing up yeah like i'd still rather not even fight one of the small ones right now yeah if anything i feel less prepared and equipped after eating again a pretty mild amount of barbecue as barbecue meals go (laughs) still not ready to fight uh Anything. The, um, the the flies are leading me oh, pretty far east of zone 7. So rip your called shot. Zone 12. Ooh. Spores. That, we sh- our face should not be that close to that. How did we survive this long? <laughs> it's. It feels like that's the question and the answer. <laughs> There's something very, like, fantasy dwarf vibes about the hunters in Monster Hunter. That's just sort of like, hey, we, we, like, we live hard, we party, we eat big meals, we drink, we're like weirdly unkillable. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like anytime in like fantasy you see like a dwarf like fly like, you know, 30 feet in the air and then land on their head, they're like, oh darn, you know, like that that's <laughs> the extent of damage they took. <laughs> they're like, ah shucks. Yeah, very cartoon logic. Well, this thing looks rad and a little scary. Wow. That's a proper scary Watch one. Yourself. Yeah, look at it. Well, uh, you're welcome to join now. I'm departing as we speak. Excellent. What is this effect on this thing? Like, is it going to try to sleep me? Has it got something else? Go- I don't know. I'll, you know, I'll try hitting it. <laughs> hitting it? Just to start. At that, that, there's no way. We'll see. Oh, like, whoa. Yeah, it's breathing angrily. I see. Okay. What you doing? Oh, big breath. Okay. What is this status you've hit me with? Ah, my maximum HP. Where did it go? It's gone. I see. And... Yippee. 
current amount of HP still descending pretty rapidly. Is this... This is not the same status that we would get hit with down there before, and it's just carrying it around with it, right? It's... It's like a... Like... Totally new thing. Wow. I don't know if, like, the... Like, if... What was what it? Effluvia? If, effluvia or something? Yeah. I don't know if the that resist stuff works on this guy. Like, I think it's a totally separate thing, but I could be wrong. Oh, boy. So they... We have our own Scarlet Rod and Monster Hunter now. <laughs> it, it, yeah. That's... What if similar, but much, much scarier. It is a very scary status effect. Wow. And uh, It drops you so fast. I'm sure nothing else gets scary about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Ow. Wow. Yeah, just being near it drops the health so fast. Yoips. Yeah, so it's got it's got kind of a um when when you when you look at the the visual of the monster, you'll see those little like pustules of spores and stuff like that. Yeah. And if they are um, pulsing, you want to not be close. Oh, okay. And I think attacking them activates them too. Oh wow. wow. But it's it's kinda like like you know like the other monsters like Vulcana and stuff like that where like it'll it'll shed the spores at some point and we can actually get some beaten in. That's good, because yeah, its tail is pretty covered right now. Yeah, because it's it's very it feels almost very like hit and run for anything that's not when it's weak, you know? Yeah, very. How to get the status effect off too? I'm curious if I I don't know if I have am able to like change decorations and stuff at camp or whatever. I'm curious if like the uh, effluvia resist would do anything to this or not. Yeah, I don't think I've ever tried. Uh, that's a good thing that we could test. Because that would make a world o difference. Oh, I don't like that. that. Beam across is very scary. Don't bite. I forgot to take off the thunderproof mantle. <laughs> it's a mystery why I have that on. <laughs> Dan and I did do a little bit of a stream hunting a week or so ago before recording this just to honestly just for fun but uh mm -hmm. it was helpful for getting some more parts getting a little bit more of the, these sets put together dying to kieran more times than anyone should that's just that's just kieran fights in a nutshell though right yeah it's just how it goes No, I should not stand here. Not even a little. Wow, it's... It was already a real cool-looking monster, and I... Like, I don't know if I... Whoa. I okay. don't know if I like this so, one better, but boy, it's cool. Now what? The very slight change in the floor is very deadly. <laughs> so Whoa. it's really hard to see. You can kind of see, like... Like, standing right in front of me, it's there's, like, ashy under this plant. Oh, I see. It will, it will take you, like, very rapidly. Just sap your health real quick. Okay, noted. Yeah. Yikes. But it's nice of him to uh, do that and run away, so we don't have to fight here. Very. Very kind. Grateful. Yeah. Yeah, I can't tell if I like the look of this one better than the previous one, but it is rad. Oh! <laughs> Hi. Wow. Didn't realize you were coming at me quite that fast. Yeah, he was he was on a mission. Yeah, seriously. Well, I can dip in here. I don't think I can change decorations in here, but if they would let me. Or if I... There's no way I have a charm that's like a Fluvium Resist 3. No way. That would be too convenient. 
Yeah, way too convenient. No way. <laughs> <laughs> we can dream. If we fail the hunt, well, then that'll be a fine chance to try getting that thrown together. Not that that's going to happen. Not at all. Nah. Oh, I got the tail. Hey, nice. Yeah, it's, it's kind of hard to choose which one of these I like more because the, the like corpse versus fungi like approach is like they're both really cool. They're real cool. Oh, don't. It's my health. I need that. I need him to have that. This is gonna hurt a bit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nope. Oh, so is that the stuff on the ground? Okay, no, it clears pretty fast. It, it, yeah, it's only when he does the um, explosion that'll stay on the ground. Gotcha. But it's that same visual that he like leaves behind for a second. Oof. Please don't bite me. I have half of my health for some reason. I'm really scared about that fungus on the tail. Nice. Nice. Definitely don't have like a quarter of my health going into this. That's fine. Oh boy. All right, come down. Perfect timing for a big hit. Feels good. Big hit too. Oh yeah. It was a 950. It wasn't four digits. I'm sorry. I was trying, Dan, you know. <laughs> it's okay. Sorry to, I'd like to apologize to all my fans. <laughs> oh, oh no. I thought it was behind the tree. No, the breath. That breath is scary. It really is. He, he does like a sweep back and forth to it, which is like very uncool. Oh boy. Yep. There's mine. Oof. Okay. Yeah. We let's 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 test the effluvium. <laughs> let's check out our uh, resistances here, because he's he's mean. Yeah. Very mean. Yeah. I wonder if I should go. Charge Blade wasn't terrible. I really feel like Lance is just asking to, especially in, if I don't know if that Effluvia stuff is gonna <laughs> protect me. Yeah, that uh, could be, it could work against you. <laughs> yeah, uh, could try bow. Might do it, let's see. Okay, I think, I think I have like, Apothecary Mantle maybe might be good. That's not a bad idea. I don't know if I've ever really done this part of monster huntering on, like, the playthrough on screens. Because, like, there's so much you can do with trying to gear up specifically for a fight if you're having difficulty with it. Uh, including changing some of, the, like, the decorations and whatnot that you put in your armor pieces. So, let's see. Current equipment. I mean, I like a lot of this stuff here a lot, but... Where do I have some resistance miasma jewel? Okay, if I could get one of these in here. I'm gonna, yeah, now that's worth doing for this occasion. A miasma jewel for greatly reducing buildup. And then if I can get one more going, it'll Prevent effluvia buildup. Whether that has anything to do with what that thing's hitting us with? No idea. But I hope. Uh, okay. Miasma jewel, miasma jewel. I'm gonna try it too. And yes. Okay, I have got full effluvial resistance now. So we're going to find out very quickly. <laughs> I 
Fine occasion to get a big steak from Meowskular Chef, though. Oh, yeah. You gotta get some way down there. Yeah. It's for old time's sake. So we still don't know, as of recording, tons about Monster Hunter Wilds, but I had perused the wiki page. Uh, just one of the fan wiki pages that just kind of had all the information we know about it so far. And it is already a wild read <laughs> in terms of the sorts of things that they are doing. Like, okay, Turf Wars, that like this new fancy thing where monsters fight each other that was already a pretty bonkers addition in this are going to be, quote, more elaborate <laughs> <laughs> and involve more than just two monsters. Oh, you know. Monsters will now roam in packs. Because <laughs> we needed that. More elaborate. Yeah, more elaborate packs of monsters fighting. Uh, <laughs> That's crazy. I, I liked the idea that they, they said with the packs where there'll be like one quote unquote alpha, you know? <laughs> yeah. That you can you can kind of go for and then the rest of the pack will leave you alone kind of thing. Oh, uh, it's so cool sounding. I can't wait. I know. Man, sometimes like I'm just like I'm looking around just in like the far backgrounds and I'm like, mm -hmm. I don't there's so much work put into video games that you don't appreciate. <laughs> it's so true. It is so true. <laughs> Even in a game like this that demands and, like, surprises and delights you with things to appreciate all the time. Like, you, here's an ice sculpture of a Rathalos with a bunch of cats in Hawaiian shirts working on it. And there's a whole party area. Like, that commands your attention, and that's cool. But then you just look at all the other stuff that's not in immediate focus. And, yeah. boy, it's really impressive to look at. So much. So cool. It's amazing. Okay, let's go do that, but better. All right, you got it. We had to remind the audience that these hunts are dangerous. Yeah, yeah. They are actually hard. I know we make them look easy all the time, if not effortless, but um, just so you know. Drink your apple juice. Can't forget the apple juice, and what's this other one? Um... Cranberry? Ooh, yeah. What is your what is your cranberry combo juice preference? Because there's like twenty. <laughs> yeah, there's there's a lot. Um one thing I used to do a lot back in the day was a little cran raspberry with Sprite. That was like a, a favorite drink of mine. I like um, that. I do like I think cran raspberry and cran grape were were my two favorites. But I feel like almost as an adult, I'm like, I kind of want to dilute them a little bit. Like, yeah, they're very sweet and strong. They are definitely. I do that kind of a lot, too. Just diluting them a bit. Just like a little bit with uh, just some uh, carbonated water. There's a better word for that that I can't yeah. think of the right this second. Real nice mix. I agree. Love that. I go for like cran pomegranate. Which is nice. Ooh, cran pomegranate is good. Yeah. I actually had some cran apple too, and that was actually, I liked that. That's really good. I don't think I'd ever tried that before. I love where our conversations go. <laughs> oh, wait, before you run up there. Yeah. This is like one of my all time favorite things just in nature. Ooh. Is the like, the light reflection off the water, like hitting Ooh. like the rocks like that. Yeah. Oh. It's big, like a. Uh, Zora's Fountain in Ocarina of Time. I yeah. always think about it. I love that too. I don't even notice it. That, like there's so much detail to the foliage and everything. Like it just, you start, I start seeing it in a little bit of gray box as I'm trying to like navigate it yeah. every now and then. But then when yeah, you stop and look around, wow, there's a lot of gorgeous detail around here. Question, are there spikes right here where I'm standing for you? Yes. I will gather them. Could there be an even bigger, meaner Nergigante? No, no, no. <laughs> I was just like, huh. <laughs> they really just put that out there, didn't they? <laughs> <laughs> For the whole world to see. Was he going to be under rocks? 
No. Oh. Wait. Where, where are my flies taking me? They're taking us to a nook of the woods that I forgot existed. If I have ever... I don't know if I've ever been here. <laughs> okay, this is looking familiar. There are parts of this forest that I, I feel like I have not been since the start of the game. Right? It's an amazing map, but you like you don't need to travel a lot of it because the monsters don't. Yeah. All right, let's see how this works. I hope it's good. Please work good. I'm not feeling any effects yet, but this may not have been hit by something that would do it. Seems okay. There's a clean 1,000 on the face. Gorgeous. Yep, we are safe from this effect. Thank goodness. Very nice. Still hurts, but like... <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, that's a relief. Okay. The apothecary mantle did not do the trick, though. Oh, no. So I am still with baby health. Oh no. Now oh, the last HP is the only one that matters, I'm told. Exactly. Come down. Oh, nice. Nice. Kabooms. That felt like a lot of damage. Oh, pretty good. You know what? The Apothecary Mantle might have actually been enough, but I think because I don't have it upgraded, it, like, uh, uh, immediately broke. Oh, no. Oh, he's exploding. Oh, he's exploding. And I bet that stuff on the ground probably still hurts. Oh, I'm in a hurts. very bad spot. Oh, I'm in a very bad spot, man. Does the ground still hurt? I'm going to test this. Yes, ground still hurts. Still don't be standing there, even with full effluvia resistance. Wow, that stuff's everywhere. Yeah, everywhere's kind of bad right now. Everywhere's super bad right now. Oh, and he's slurping my life up. Hey, guy, could you come over here? It's like the one safe place I can find to stand. Nope. Now, where'd he go? I hope he's leaving because I am. Um, nope, he's just behind me, is all. Whoever saved me. Good cat. <laughs> Good little barbarian mm -hmm. cat. Poor timing to come up over that tree root. Ow. I should come be a little more of a distraction. Sounds like um He 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 got mad at me, Dan. Weird, I don't know why. Just because you're the only one doing damage over here. 
There's no reason to take it out on you. Hey! Alright. Oh, I keep thinking this is Rise and I can take the toad with me. <laughs> Wait, you can take the toads with you in Rise? Yeah, you can... All the little, um... Like, critters and stuff, you pick them up and deploy them in Rise. Oh, wow, I'd forgotten all about that. So, like, the paratoads and sleep toads, it's like... The bet it's one of my favorite things about Rise. Oh, that's great. I'd forgotten that detail. Don't bite. He, he did a bite. Now, I probably shouldn't stood back instead of continuing to do hits. One of these days, I'll learn. Stop slurping my life. I need that. Yeah, whatever it's doing, I don't want to be near it. Yeah, if you see the, um, the, like, dust getting pulled into him, if you have it on you, it'll, he steals your health. Yipes. Well, that felt good, though. This is not going to hit. Nope. Oh, it's poison now. Nice. Of all the things, I would not have expected this to get poison. Right? Ah. Oh. I was going to do a cool thing, La Hazak. This does seem like the sort of creature that has transcended the idea of poison entirely. Yeah. Uh, big kaboom, big kaboom. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna stand over here. Uh, Hazak, you can come over here when you're ready to continue fighting. Wow, you're just going right in. I saw a big open spot in the center of the mess, and I'm like, I'm going for it. <laughs> okay, it was a bad it was a bad idea, Dan. It was a bad idea. Uh, oh no. Oh my gosh, how am I alive? Whew. <laughs> yeah, you're still just in the thick of it. Doing your thing. Yeah. Ah, thought that was gonna go over me again. Would you, would you not? <laughs> okay, ground is no longer garbage. Yay. Happy day. We love that. Yep. Stand back, stand back. Sh he's slurping my life again. Stop slurping. Oh, and he's got, he's got spores again. Oh, good. Hey, I was gonna... Okay. I was finally making myself useful. <laughs> These Nergi thorns are just everywhere. Probably nothing. That thing's just leaving foreshadowing all over the place. I feel like these spores coming off of this thing would smell less bad than you would think, and that makes them more unsettling to me. <laughs> yeah. There's probably like a kind of like musty sweetness to them. 
Like an old book. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever have you ever experienced the like sweet smell of of rotting meat? No, not that specifically. It's very weird and unpleasant because your body knows like this shouldn't smell good because it's rotten. Yeah, <laughs> and it's meat like, but it has like a weird kind of like unnatural sweetness to this you almost like fruity that's perfectly unsettling it's very hey hey nice i wonder if it's safe to tenderize while you've done that probably not right i think i think you might be able to get a tenderized off i'll go for the tail or something if i can okay Nice. Okay, yeah. Coming down. Excellent. Just hold right there. Kaboom. Yes. Feels good. Oh. He moved his head in such a way I, I whiffed, <laughs> Dan. Oh, no. Evil. Very evil. Terrible dragon. We have to kill it. It's the only way. We oh. have to nuke it from orbit. The only way to be sure. How is that tail still out? It's a great question. Ow. I don't know how you manage to not die at, like, most of the time without a shield, <laughs> without another you being distracting. <laughs> Samson, Samson does some pretty good, uh... defense for me, you know? Gives, get nice distraction. Yeah, true. Samson has been doing great work. I mean, you've clearly, like, you've got a sense for... There goes the tail, I think. Nice. You've got a sense for the timing on these things, that you know where your windows are, and you're <laughs> good at choosing them. I do like, I do like to learn <laughs> their, their <laughs> sets, because it's, it's, it's very satisfying being like, this is my perfect opportunity. Yeah, yeah. I imagine that must feel good. Cause like I have that thought, and then I quickly realize. Wait, no, it was not. Ow. <laughs> it's always when the monsters like can do like a combo or like a, a, a cancel of a move into another move and that always throws me for a loop because I'm like, yep, that's not what they would do. Yeah, it's when they're in their kind of like fury mode where suddenly there will be a one move that can actually have a follow up where it usually doesn't. Yeah. It's like I just finally learned your whole vanilla set. Consistency, please. Ow. Thanks, Quivers. Doing great. Those little jackresses are. Pinning me in a corner. <laughs> Little jerks. I'm afraid I haven't charged up the shield yet. It's gonna, it's gonna end bad for both of us if you guys oh, nice. get out of my way. Bonk. A little too late. 
Ow, uh, come on, man. Face is tenderized. Nicely done. I was doing scary. More healing, come on. Finding somewhere safe to stand. Okay, great. Haha! -ha! Ooh, nice. Big hit, come on. Stay put, please. Thank you, all right. Now. Stop it. Oh, he's exploded. Uh oh. <coughs> Excuse me. It's, it's all these spores. <laughs> That's my allergies, you know. So this is the power of an Elder Dragon. <laughs> hey, Vahazak, do you think you could... Like, good job clapping the erasers together, buddy. Could you come out here, please? <laughs> Thank you. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, I'm over here. Isn't this nicer? Deep breaths, fresh air. Ow, come on, man. Yeah, it's like, we we get that you're all like, like oh, spores and fungus, that's your whole vibe, you know, but it, it, breathing in not fresh air it can't be great. Like, <laughs> it's definitely the elder dragon with a smoker's cough. <laughs> Like, I don't know if it's actually real or if it's just urban legend that people have been, like, smoking long enough to where if they kind of, like, hold their breath for a second, even without smoking, and then just exhale, you can see a little bit of smoke come out. <laughs> that feels like <laughs> urban legend now that I say it out loud. But, uh... Real for this dragon, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's doing it right now. You can see his, his breath year-round. Man, I am, I am like, tapped on healing. I'm pretty low myself. Might actually have to go to base and get healing. What is this? A tactical retreat? Unheard of. I know. Quivers, you're doing great, laying down there, bud. Really are. <laughs> Good hit. Nope. Come on, man. Don't do that. Oh, there's a shiny on the floor, though. Ooh. Love that. Stop. Death Weaver Membrane. That's the coolest part of a monster that's ever existed. Yeah, that's amazing. Good name. Nice. I snuck in like a quick nine hundo on the face. Ooh, very nice. Come on. Let me tenderize some more. There we go. Right near camp too. This honestly is a great chance to restock. Yeah, I think I think that's probably good play because I, I I ran out of base potions. So that's how you know it's bad. Oh wow. Yeah, I'm definitely out of my mega potions and had to dip into the max potions a little too.
Just a quick little breather. Have some tea. There we go. Eh. Both, I, I like how both of our uh, palicos had a sneak in a cat pun there. <laughs> I, want, I just saw, yeah. Like, let's pause to recuperate. Wait, I'm at 100%. <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> I love this silly game. <laughs> We're fighting a giant undead dragon thing. Please take this seriously. Like, bards are going to sing about this later. <laughs> Gonna get this weapon charged up over here while. You wanna you wanna leave the smoke, please? Yeah, thank you. Gonna make me run through this, aren't you? Run, 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 run. Ow, ow, that was a mistake ow, then. Ow, ow. Yeah, I too have made a mistake. Yeah. Oh no. I got, I got bopped with it and pushed into the blight oh, area. Oh, mean. Very mean. Stop. Uh-oh. Don't be right in front of it. Oh, I'm, I just can't even get to him. Oh, I think it cleared up. Ow. Oh, nice. Eek. Very nice. Oh, I don't actually know how that happened. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. Yeah, very good. Oh, nice. The double knockdown. Yeah. Love to see it. Oh, 1,200. Wow, goodness. Actually getting a moment of bullying this thing, and it feels nice. I know. Hey, nice. Oh, I thought you mounted it. Whoop. Eh, some of that connected. I'll take it. I'm finally kind of remembering how to charge blade a little. Ugh, man. What a mess. Ow. Thanks, Quivers. I'm gonna tenderize, I don't think it's gonna work. Hey, it did. Nice. Hey, it's limping. Oh, ho, ho. beautiful. We're gonna get it. Whew. Where are you going? There's rocks we can drop on you here. Don't know if these will knock it down, but... Oops. Got myself all tired. Ow. Hey, come over here. I wanna try. Hey, hey, look over here. Look over here. This way. Right over here. Come on. 
No, 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 no. Don't go through that. Hey, guy. Stand underneath the little rock chandelier. Or, you know. That's fair. You'd already decided you were doing this. Nice. Come back here. Just go with it. <laughs> hey. Uh oh. Oh, I ran out of stamina, that's why. Soften up the face. Yeah. From the top rope. <laughs> what you doing, big guy? Oh, he's stealing health. Ooh. Nice try, fool. I don't have it right now. <laughs> Tough break, burglar. I'm broke. <laughs> Nice. Hey, hold still. Oh, don't do that. I was doing it. Oh. Nope. Still nope. From the top rope again. Get him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yes. Beautiful. And, oh, where are you going? Where are you going? He was trying to leave. Oh, he's he's just going. Oh, yeah, you're just you're bye. <laughs> he's just keeping you as a pet. Oh, he's coughing everywhere. Oh, there I, we go. Didn't nice. even get me. I think he's low. Hey, hey. hey. we did it. Great work, nice. Feels good. Yeah, that one was cool. I, uh, I'm very excited for the next hunt, Dan. Ooh, the next one. I'm, I'm excited for all the rest of them. Like, all the, uh, all the Iceborne monsters have been amazing. And I know we've only got a few, or like a handful of, like, main story hunts left in this. Uh, so I'm very excited to see what they've been saving kind of for the home stretch. Mm hmm. Hmm. What a mess this thing is. I used to like coming up to this tree area because there was always like free Rathalos scales up here. Oh yeah, just around. Yeah. But I mean, none this time. Whew. Even with gear to protect against the status effect. Not a pushover. Yeah. I hit master rank 120. Yo. I'm 20, so... Nice. Catching up. <laughs> Catching up. I better, I better put a move on. Five more of those and I'll be neck and neck with you. <laughs> On your Great. left. <laughs> 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 hey, you're back. Great work out there. It's good to see you safe. We'll get our scholars on site with an escort straight away. This is going to be huge. The investigation into that song and the seismic action is progressing too. It's no surprise, but the commission's incredible. Yeah. Anyway, rest up. Once you're feeling ready, we'll get you back out in the field to the Coral Highlands. I think that's where we're spread thinnest. Let's go. Head there and keep searching for any Elder Dragon tracks. Thanks, Hunter. Are you going to make me do more Looks research? Like are you kidding? Needing to investigate the elder I was researching so much. Fine. 
I've got more Elder Dragon research to do, apparently. Oh, Elder Dragon research. Ugh, homework. <laughs> Fine. You know, we can <laughs> join you in the hub, at least, to sign off. I'll do this research off camera, and we will see you next time to hunt something else big and cool, probably. We like big and cool. Love big and cool. Also love this Pouquet thing so much. Very good. It's adorable. Look at it. It's wonderful. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you next time. Where did I leave? Wave or these other... Somewhere in here, I'm sure I had a... Uh, ha ha! Goodbye, everyone! <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs>